it's Dom. Yes, sir, David. So what we have right now is a privately held Purdue Pharma and its main family asset backers, the Sackler family, have now agreed to pay $270 million to resolve claims by the Oklahoma Attorney General that the company did help kind of fuel the opioid crisis. That's according to a person familiar with the matter. Uh, the settlement, again, expected to, release, to be released later on in, in the course of this. But this is the first, the reason why it's important, this is the first of more than 1,600 opioid-related lawsuits that Purdue Pharma does face. And Purdue Pharma has already said that it is exploring a possible bankruptcy as an option that could help it resolve some of those claims. But still, the first big one, David, Jim, in terms of OxyContin and some of the opioid epidemic.